All right, so in this video, I'm solving the equation x to the power of 3 is equal to 3 to the power of 3. So to solve this, I'm going to first start by subtracting 3 to the power of 3 on both sides. So now I get x to the power of 3 minus 3 to the power of 3 is equal to 0. Now from here, if I have something in the form a to the power of 3 minus b to the power of 3, this is equal to a minus b times a squared plus ab plus b squared. So this turns into x minus 3 times x squared plus 3x plus 9 is equal to 0. So now from here I get two equations. I get x minus 3 equals 0 and x squared plus 3x plus 9 is equal to 0. So obviously for x minus 3 equals 0, x is equal to 3. So this is one solution. And now for x squared plus 3x plus 9 equals 0, I can use the quadratic formula which is negative b plus or minus the square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a. So this turns into negative 3 plus or minus the square root of 3 squared, which is 9, minus 4 times a, which is 1, times c, which is 9, all over 2a, so 2 times 1. And this turns into negative 3 plus or minus the square root of 9 minus 36 over 2, which is equal to negative 3 plus or minus the square root of negative 27 over 2, which is equal to negative 3 plus or minus the square root of 27 times the square root of negative 1 over 2. Now, 27 is the same thing as 9 times 3. And the square root of 9 is 3, so I get x is equal to negative 3 plus or minus 3 root 3. And the square root of negative 1 is actually equal to the imagined number i. So these are two more solutions to this equation.